Now, now just yes, uh, find the reduced form of the ratio of the first quantity to second quantity. This is our question. This is sub question number six, where question says. Uh, 7 minute 20 second is our first quantity, 5 minute 6 second is our second quantity. So we need to find out ratio of the first quantity to second quantity in, uh, sim uh, in reduced form or in simplified form. So first quantity that is 7 minutes, 20 seconds. So 7 minutes can be converted into seconds as 7 into 60 plus 20 seconds is there. So it would be 420 plus 20 that is 440. This is our first quantity. And second quantity is 5 minutes, 6 seconds. This quantity can be converted into seconds as 5 minutes, that is 5 into 60 will give, uh, give us seconds, plus 6, so it is 300 plus 6, that is 306. So first quantity is 440 second quantity is 306 ratio of the first quantity to second quantity in reduced form can be written as 440 upon 306 here 2 into 220 upon 2 into 153 so 2 2 is common which we can cancel so we will left with 220 upon 153 and this is a required ratio that is 220 is to 152 this is simplified form or reduced form of the given uh, ratio of given quantities hope it is clear to everybody Question, this is question number 3. Express the following percentage as a ratio in the reduced form. So when we are talking about percentage, denominator should be 100. So I will take uh, first question. Here, in first question, the numbers are 75 is 200. Uh, express the percentage as a ratio in the reduced form question says so this can be written as 75 upon 100 this is the form of percentage because denominator is 100 now <coughs> after that we need to uh, convert it into simplified form of uh, reduced form of ratio so i'll factorize i'll find out common factor which we can uh, you know take out from numerator as well as denominator so here this 75 can be written as 25 threes are, and 100 can be written as 25 fours are. so 25 25 is common so you can cancel from numerator and denominator and it would be 3 by 4 and this is a reduced form of ratio that is 3 is to 4. So 75 percent is actually 3 is to 4. Now second question, uh, second you will do, uh, I am going to do third question. Third one 6.25 percent. This is our third question. In order to write it in the form of percentage, you can write it as 
6.25 so look this is 6.25 uh, in order to write it in per percentage we can take 100 in the denominator so here I will take upon 100 and then this ratio can be multiplied with 100 in numerator as well as in denominator so this decimal can be moves so I am multiplying 100 in numerator 100 in denominator so this will look like uh, 625 upon 100 into 100 will become 10,000 like this this 25 into 25 is 625 and this 10,000 can be factorized as 25 4 that means this 10,000 is a product of 100 into 100 so 100 is actually 25 4 into 25 4 so these 225 in numerator and denominator will cancel we left with uh, 1 upon 4 4 is 16 so 1 upon 16 and this is the reduced form of the ratio that is 1 is to 16 now last question which I am going to solve is question number 4 yes question number 4 is 52 is 200 52 is 200 can be written as 52 upon 100 52 can be factorized as 13 into 4 and 100 can be factorized as 25 into 4 so 4 4 will cancel we will have 13 upon 25 so 13 is to 25 is a reduced form of the given percentage So this is your solution for question number 1, 3 and 4. It's your turn to uh, give me a solution for question number 4, 2 and 5. Yes, everybody, try question number 2 and 5. Three persons can build a small house in 8 days. So we, a number of people are 3. They take 8 days to construct one house. To build the same house in 6 days, how many persons are required? So here we can consider, let X people, X persons are required So if X persons are required to build the same house, so here first condition in first condition three persons doing certain work to construct one small house. So how total work done, total work done by three persons is equal with number of persons into number of days so here we have three persons they are working for eight days so total work done by them is 28 it's 24 this is total work done by the three persons in order to build one small house similarly when the uh, when these uh, these uh, people x number of people work for 6 days 
they will do same amount of work so here we can say that x into 6 would be equal with 24 I am keeping x on its place 24 on its place this 6 can be transposed to the other side so x will be 4 so 6 persons or 4 persons are required to build the same house in 6 days